combine instruments to Aspayan to have a median empowerment in accordance with the OSC principles and commitments. This is in accordance with democratic principles and democratic values of freedom of expression and freedom of media. Bu kitap bir məktəbdir. Atət məkanında yaşayan hər bir vətəndaşa öz ölkəsinin məhbatın özünün tənzilənməsi, durmayasların peşə davranışı, mətbuat işlovlarının fəaliyyəti, mətbuat üzrə ambusmanın təhsilatın yaranması və bağlı dərin bilgiləri verir. Burada Azərbaycanda yaranacaqdır və həmin üstün qurulmasında bu kitabda göstərilən dəyərli tövsiyyələr də öz faydası verəcəkdir. Azərbaycan jurnalistləri medyanın özünün tənzənməsinə gəlmək üçün uzun bir yol çeşiblər. Və nəhayət 2003-cü il martın 15-də meydan özünün tənzənməsi qurumu olan Mətbar Şurası yaranıbdır. Mətbar Şurası biz yaradarkən dünya təcrübəsini öyrənmişik və əsasən Avropa təcrübəsini götürüb Azərbaycanda Mətbar Şurasını qura bilmişik. Bu kitabda eyni zamanda Atət məkanında Mətbaa şuralarının fəaliyyətlindən, rolundan, cəmiyyətdə oynadığı Qarşı tanıdığımız dostumuz Vlatevin Bolqarsa Mətbaa şurasının yaranması Onun iki yıl bundan əvvəl Bolqarsdan dolarıkən tanış olmuşam Azərbaycan Mətbaa şurası yalnız yazın mətbaatdan olan şəhətləri qəbul edir İnformasiya vasitələrində məhz əxlaq qozilisi də bağlı problemlərinin əlində bu problemlərin bu məsələlərin məhbar şuratına cəmlənməsində bir ictimai sifariş vardır. Ümumiyyətlə, əlbəttə, hakimiyyətlə medianın münasibətləri bugünkü günümüzün əsas məsələlərinin biridir biz buna yəni ki, hamımız razıyıq, çünki artıq uzun müddət ki, çox kimi problemlər yaşa getməyəcək və bu problemlərin tam fiksəriyyətdə hakimiyyətin kəsişmə nöqtəsində yaranır. Biz ordur to cover things and that is not a friend of quality. Second, ensuring self-restraint, non-interference with the media. Third, helping the media to be pluralistic. That is applying in the legal field rigorous anti-monopolism to to make sure that the media is in numerous hands enough to stay pluralistic. And finally, removing from the body of laws all kind of speech restrictions that are illegitimate. Only to keep criminal responsibility only for actual incitement against actual legal order, actual incitement to actual violence. This is the legitimate criminalization of speech, and all the rest, like libel, like defamation, or any kind of uh, insult should be not criminal responsibility, it should be citizen between, be, dispute between citizens and not a dispute between the state and citizens like Germany. Yeah. Media bodies which are absolutely quality. That is a utopia as far-fetched as communism used to be. There is no such thing as a fully, fully responsible media. What you can have and what you can only have in freedom 
is the possibility for quality media. And the press council and media self-regulation is nothing but a club, a club of those media which report, I would like to be responsible media. By being member of the complaint mechanism provided by media self-regulation, editors, publishers, journalists declare that my outlet, my paper will be the medium of democracy. We will be responsible. If we do mistakes, then we honestly correct it. We double check our facts. We are reliable. And that amount of media, I'm sorry if this is bad news for some people, will always be a minority among the whole media. You always have commercial media, you always in freedom, you always have you always have media that is not caring about reliability, only about sensations. Please government, don't mix don't mix these two types of things. Please work to help the serious media to be free to be responsible. And don't despair if uh, the road is very difficult. It is difficult for us. In this book, you have four authors. I myself have authored this book, but as already was mentioned by the president of the press council, uh, Ognan Zlatyam, the head of the Bulgarian press council, has contributed. The head of the Unite, uh, United Kingdom, the Britain, Press Complaints Commission, which is the, uh, the successor of the original Press Council, which was the first in the world. Now it's called the UK Press Complaints Commission. Mm -hmm. He wrote a chapter. Um, a French ombudswoman uh, from Le Monde has written a chapter because in many countries uh, there is no national press council like in France or in the US but there are individual ombuds people in the papers, and that is also a very good and very effective method of self-regulation. Very quickly, so that there will be time for other questions. As Ambassador Herrero has mentioned, I will have a um, general press conference tomorrow. And uh, I will be able to answer these questions more thoroughly than now, tomorrow, because I am still in front of important meetings today and tomorrow. I met it, um, and um, some other people, and I will have a very important meeting with the presidential administration and with other authorities. And I will be able to answer your question more thoroughly because of these meetings tomorrow. But I don't, don't want to escape the gist of your question with one sentence, yes, we are observing the situation, we are observing, as I already mentioned, the criminalization of journalism as well as criminalization of extra journalistic activities in case of critical journalists.